Hello everyone, I am Brian, your host for the evening. Bet you weren't expecting to see me, were you? As League's sidekick. Uh, 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 excuse me, you're not my sidekick. My apologies, as League's partner in crime. You're not my partner in crime, either. Ahem, as League's partner in crime, I wanted to thank the following supporters for their ideas. First contributor, please hold applause until the end. Thank you. I just wanted to pop in here very quickly and just say League of Liars received its first monetary donation of this week. So I just wanted to shout you out, EB. I won't say your whole name just in case you don't want that out there. And please let me know if you guys don't like shout outs. So I will definitely respect that. But I really just wanted to say thank you to all all of my liars i started this channel as just a pure reaction channel like i never expected it to go this route and you guys truly don't know how much you help me each and every day it's i've had some moments where i just woke up and was just in a really bad space and then i just see all of you guys and you just you bring me sunshine like you bring me happiness i love my liars that's that's it i love you guys and i appreciate all of you thank you for being there for me without even knowing that you're being there for me i love all of you guys you're all my liars all right let's get back to the show take it away brian and without further ado League of Liars presents being Andrew Caldwell, Andrew versus the Neighborhood. Today is going to be a great day. Desi Banks will stop by the show. I'm ready for him. I have been practicing all of my good shade and reads. What's up, man? My name is Desi Banks. I'm a comedian from Atlanta. I'm just stopping by the radio show to promote my tour. I ain't worried about delivered. Drew, please act like you have some sense. I know you like to throw shade, but can you just chill out for today, please? Can you be normal just this once? But look, Shorty, I wrote down all my good reads. I will not be getting embarrassed today. Let me check on my site before that boy gets her. Oh my God, everything is still fully stocked. Why aren't my supporters buying my merchandise? I did exactly what Sheree did. Take really cheap stuff, sell it for a price that's way too high, and take forever to ship it if I ship it at all. Why is this not working? Oh wait, there's something that's sold out. Never mind, that's the product I changed the inventory for so I could pretend I had sales and get on Instagram and convince people to go to my website. This has not been a good day so far. I guess I better go get ready for the show. It's your favorite radio station, 104.1, and we got your boy, Desi Banks, in the building. What's up, what's up, what's up, child? What's up, with your teeth? Why, they the same color as my pee since I don't drink water. Dark yellow. Now that's a read, right, What's up, Shorty? What's boy? Why his ass so zesty this early in the morning? Ain't nobody dicking you down. Is that why you acting like All a right, little bitch All right, y'all, DJ Chris Dowell got your morning mix coming up right now. We'll be back. Let me tell you something, you old duck-ass, fuck-ass, suck-ass, punk-ass nigga. 
Stop playing on my top, I'll fuck your ass up, old bitch ass nigga. Damn. Drew, I tried to warn you, man. Everybody don't play like that. It's okay. I already called Ryan. He said we will be dropping lawsuits. And you know Desi has those corns, so I'm gonna be rich. Oh yeah, there was someone outside asking for you. Oh, there he is. Listen here, you buck tooth ass bitch. I heard you was running your mouth about me. Keep my name out your motherfucking mouth. You, you, you. You said you want a bad one. And stay out of my DMs. You in dudes DMs, Drew? Look, shorty, all I said was I will pray for you. Wait, hold anyway, on, let me read it. He's just mad because I have been delivered and he still likes mans. Whatever you say, Drew. Oh, so you still talking shit, huh? Okay, let's get into these DMs. Okay, let's go. You know what? I don't have to prove anything. Oh, no, Mr. Cameraman. Zoom in on these DMs. Yeah, bitch, stop playing with me. I can't believe he kept those. Stupid, stupid, stupid. After a great morning, I always go home to recharge before I walk around the neighborhood. What the fuck? Andrew! You have got to be shitting me. Where'd it go? It's in the fucking microwave, Andrew. It's in the fucking microwave. Where is he, Andrew? Holy shit. Now he's in the stove. You know what? I quit. Andrew, what the hell are you doing? I'm trying to calm down. I had a rough day today. Do you not see this shit? You have a ghost in here. Oh, that's just John. He was my sugar daddy. I mean, straight male friend that helped me when I was homeless and- Andrew, not today. I've been haunting this house for years. I want you gone. But why? For years, I have watched you bring multiple men in and out. Fine. I will give you your space for today. I will be back later. My family wants to sell the house, and they can't while you're squatting here. Okay, so normally I do my shopping right after work. Hold on. Let me see if anyone bought anything on my site. I'm broke. Is that sis wearing some pink Ugg boots? I can't wait Dang to tell it, the knuckleheads nothing. about this. Wait a minute. Is that Moose Knuckle? Oh my god. I hope she didn't see me. She will read me to the fits. Security? Oh yeah, I don't have security, I just pretend I do. Let's just go to the next stop, they love me there. So, I come here to relax and yell at my phone. Okay, that's enough relaxing. Wait, are they talking about me to the manager? Excuse me, is there a problem? Well, yes, actually there is. We have been receiving complaints about your mustiness killing the flowers. They also say your breath reeks and can be smelled through the brick wall encasing the garden. There's also the matter of your loud and ignorant rants, as well as spittle flying everywhere and corroding the chairs. That is, of course, according to the complaints. Well, they're just haters with no check marks. Be that as it may, we would really appreciate it if you would limit your time in the gardens. Thank you. 
Is that who I think it is? What the hell are you doing here, Granny McRae? Hello, my name is Sir William McRae. Some people call me Granny McRae because I act like an old woman, Suga. I wear nails and weave, but I ain't no woman, Suga. I'm here because I'm still upset that Andrew became the token, clearly gay man who pretends he's straight for a brief moment. I'm still mad he said he had on Tom Ford, but it was polyester! It was polyester! Let me tell you something, boy. That wasn't no damn Tom Ford. Your back was busting out the seams of that jacket. They should have never picked you instead of me. I Are can't believe Are you for serial them. right now? You talking about something that happened years ago? I'm not doing this with you. Have fun trying to blackmail people for rent. Step your game up. My followings give me money no matter how bad I treat them. My last stop for the day is normally the park. Would you excuse me for a moment? What are you doing here, Justin? I'm here looking for someone. Don't have an attitude. I don't know why you're shaking your head. I heard you were at the bathhouse. You heard about that? Yes, Andrew. So chill out and leave me alone. You belong to me, you hear me. I will do what I want, when I want. You better be glad these cameras are here, because I would punch you. Justin, I have had a very bad day. If you push me, I will let you know what time it is. You don't want that. Blah, 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 you're not the boss of me. Still out her, I see. Didn't I tell you to go home? Did you just try to slap me? Yes, I'm tired of you threatening me. It stops today, bitch. OMG, a lover's quarrel. Let me move. I can't believe you did that, you bitch. I'm sorry, Andrew, but you deserved every bit of that, you DL floozy. Okay, I guess they're just going to be catty now. Floozy? Floozy? Floozy! How dare you? I'm not a floozy. That's why I gave you a thumbs down on the rate, your trade app. Your bussy isn't that great, so... I can't believe you said that. How could you? Okay, I think I'm done. I'm sick and tired of you, Andrew. You smell like onions. And even when you're over there, I can still smell your breath here. Really, Justin? That's it! Andrew, stop it. I don't want to beat your ass again. Did people hear that? I'm done. Today was a great day. I have this outfit and shades on because I'm going to a costume party. Yes, I know it's not Halloween, I'm not lying. It's not like I got my behind beat and I'm headed to the bathhouse or nothing. No one better think that. Anyway, today was a great day. I signed a deal with Desi and we are going on tour. Milan apologized for being so mean to me. I saw Moose Knuckle and told her what time it was. And then I had a great afternoon at the garden where everyone loves me and at the park. So, yep, today was a great day.